that exact cast and as nice as this is Things are a little dry out there, too. Well, they are. We could really use the rain. We're 2.22 inches of rain below average for the month, but uh, it looks like our rain chances will go up. Here we are looking out the window. Looks oh so pretty. And I thought you'd like to go to Washington, right, for the Pope's visit. Here is a look at what's expected. The weather there, I think, is going to totally cooperate. That rain and cloudiness staying to the south. So that's great news. Meanwhile, what we have is a frontal boundary that's just offshore. It's basically washing out, and the weather has just been beautiful today. South Shore looking gorgeous. North Shore, Mississippi Gulf Coast looks great. Let me show you what's happening. We've got this dry air that's moving in, so it's less humid out. Really feels pleasant. You can't help but notice all of this cloudiness to the east, right? What we have is an upper level load that over time is going to move to the west, and that's going to push some moisture our way. So our rain chances will begin to go up, but it's going to be the battle of the dry air against the moist air. So the truth is, I only have a slight chance of rain over the next few days. There's that weak front that's just to the south and washing out. And as we look into the Western Caribbean, you know what? Not seeing anything there. Global forecast models are saying the potential that we could have some tropical development. And if you look carefully, you'll see that there's a little bit of an east flow, a little bit of a west flow, so it's possible you could get a spin showing up there. Here is a look at our global forecast model, the GFS, and nothing is there. And then as we go into your Saturday, a little bit of rain is showing up. As we go through time Monday into Tuesday, it does show the potential for our rain chances to go up. So we're going to be watching this, the European model, also indicating that potential for low to develop in the Gulf. Meanwhile, we can look at what's happening for tomorrow. Slight chance of rain, highs in the mid to the upper 80s. The truth is, it's the same thing as you go into your Thursday, Friday. It does appear as though we'll have a slight chance of rain and maybe not quite as warm. Low temperatures this morning, oh so nice. We were in the low to the mid 60s, though at the airport we did have a low of 70 degrees. There you can see our highs. We managed to hit 90 degrees. That was at Hammond, but 85 at the airport. So 85 degrees now being reported. The humidity is really low, feels great out. Here is a look at our temperatures from 82 at the lakefront to 85 at Bell Chase. Morning low temperatures not quite as cool. Mid 60s to the low 70s and then your high temperatures tomorrow mainly in the upper 80s. Now there is a slight chance of rain for tomorrow also for Thursday and Friday. You'll notice a few more clouds and of course fall arrives in the morning at 321. Then as we look into the week we do see those rain chances going up from Monday and Tuesday. We'll watch for that potential for a low to develop in the Gulf and I'll keep you posted. All right, thank you so much.